YouTube world, welcome back to another video. Today we've got another carving video to do. So recently I became an uncle earlier this year, near the end of January. My sister had a baby girl and uh, I want to do something special for her. I got this big block of basswood. So I got a little drawing and I'm going to put her name on this, carve it out. So the first step to do is to put sanding sealer on it and then I'm going to let, let that dry. Then lay out the design and then start the carving. Put in like a nice decorative edge. And also if you haven't subscribed already, uh, please do. Give me a thumbs up on the video and uh, hit that notification bell to know when I have uh, new videos come out. So uh, let's do this. So I'm gonna let that dry for one hour. It's a quick drying sanding sealer, so uh, when we come back, I'll start laying it out. Alright guys, the uh, wood's all dried up, and I'm going to lay it out. So I got her name, and I got a nice little elephant, so I'm going to kind of center it. I'm going to do a chamfer on the edges here. I'm going to measure up and center everything up. The elephant is about six and a quarter wide and this board is 12 inches if I do two and a half on each side it should be good I'll get a light scribe two and a half the letters right here and we get these inside lines Just like that. Alright. Alright, now we have it laid out. I had uh, put in carbon paper underneath and then taped this down. I uh, used this uh, carbon graphite paper. Got it from a local hobby store. So uh, now I'm just going to trace out the whole image. See how it came out. Touch over here. Alrighty. Here how it looks so far. Alright guys, now I'm gonna go ahead and set up the router and do the edges first. Now we're going to go back and start doing the outline of the elephant and the letters. Alright guys, so I got the edges done and I just put in the uh, 60 degree V groove uh, flutes router bit so I'm gonna do inset letters I'm gonna do those first all right let's get to carving I'm gonna put the depth up to an eighth of an inch very barely, barely sticking out okay here we go
put in the profile bit. Alright, so it's set to about an eighth of an inch. Then I'll get the uh, SC50 and uh, do some of these inside lines. Right, so I drew a little cloud around the elephant. So I'm going to use the profile bit at an eighth of an inch for the inside of that line. I'm going to go a little bit deeper. And then I will uh, take the SC50 bit and detail the inside of the elephant. Put in the uh, 90 degree V groove and do the background around the uh, elephant. Paint the elephant now. So I got my acrylic paints out. I'm trying to mix up some colors. I'm gonna do like a purplish pink elephant. So let me get the right color ready.
painting is done. Now I'm gonna go ahead and protect it with some shellac. And the uh, sign is complete. Alright, here you have it everybody. Hi Penelope, I made this for you from Uncle David. Okay all, so uh, that's it. I'll catch you on the next video. So I'll uh, catch you later. Love you sis.